What's good, YouTube? It's your boy, 20 d 2 wild checking in once again, man. We are back at it like a motherfucking crack addict, man, today with a very special video. As you guys may or may not know, today is March 26th, 2017. If you don't know that, you might need to go to the hospital. Unless you're looking at this in the future, then you're all right. But today is Air Max Day, guys, and I wanted to do something a little bit different, and I know there's going to be tons of Air Max videos out, but I wanted to just go through and show you guys my small but nice Air Max collection. As you know guys, the Air Max was created March 26, 1987 by Tinker Hatfield himself. Now, I don't know how long Tinker had been in the game at that time, but I would have to say this was probably one of the designs that just boosted him, you know, made him who he is today, later going on to make the Jordan models that we all love so much. So, huge shout out to Tinker Hatfield for making something such, such a dope sneaker and just starting a sneaker culture that today still, you know, resonates through the, the, through the, through the generation of me and people going forth you know what I'm saying much respect to the Air Max and you know just everything about it now my favorite Air Max would have to be the 98 I forgot the name of it I think it's the 98 Ultra I'll make sure to put a picture right here that is probably one of my most favorite Air Max releases ever. I remember having those when I was little and I destroyed them. And then also being the 97, the all silver joints that we, you know, supposed to be having a re-release sometime this year. I think even next month. I, I don't fully know. However, your boy does not have those in his possession, so I'm taking the L on that. But we do have a few good things here that I would like to get into. So let's get it, man. Let's go. First being here at Chance Sports, man. I'm probably going to be giving these away to Nikki's dad today so he can have something to rock for Air Max Day. This is is let me see the exact name this is the 90 but it's like a 90 like different type of 90 this is the air max 90 ultra breath so it has a lot of ventilation going on have not worn this sneaker but it is a dope ass sneaker so i have too many kicks that it's hard to get to every single one but this right here is a really nice sneaker all red with the white laces got the breathability breathability going on on the vents and all that so definitely a dope kick and um a nice selection for air max day but i'm gonna give these away to somebody i'm giving away to her dad today so you can have something funk, you know what I'm saying? He wears my size, so he just a lucky motherfucker. Next up, now, I don't know if you would classify these as an Air Max, but I mean, it is what it says on the box. Let me know why this is classified as an Air Max if it is, and why it's not if it isn't classified, if I would like to know. I'm just reading it based upon the box. Air Max Penny DB. Now here we go. The Penny One, I don't know why, but for some reason it seems that if it's, it's clear, classic, I mean, it says Air Max, and even on the sole, I don't think on this one, but I do know on one of the soles, it says Air Max on it, or maybe it's on the bottom, I think it says it. Nike Air, it says it somewhere, I think on the insole on the regular version, but this is a DB version, so it is like harder to, you know, um, put, you know, they don't put, they put all sorts of other type of stuff on here, but this is my Penny One DB, my only pair of pennies, one of my favorite models, still waiting on the Orlando Magic colorway to drop, but it's it just hasn't dropped all three of them. I've worn these a few times. Huge shout out to J8, uh, Jake H Kicks. I have not heard from him in a long time. Wherever you at, bro, shout out to you. Thanks for the love and support on the assist on that. I got these for retail because of him. And they're just still in my collection till this day, man. Still intact, got the sticker and all that. One, this is one of, I would say, two DBs I got. I don't have that many DBs in my collection, so one of two. JK Kicks, man, shout out to you, bro. Next up, man, we got another package in here from Hess, man. Shout out to Hess in the motherfucking building. Hess Kicks, this is the 98 Supreme collab, Air Max 98 Supreme. Very, very dope model. And I think when I said 98 before that I was wrong, that might not be the 98. I, I will figure out and I will make sure to put, you know, correct myself on that part. But this is a Supreme collab they did. They did this in various colorways and a lot of people hopped on it just because of the Supreme thing. I hopped on it because the model was dope, but then the Supreme thing at the same time. So I ain't gonna see him a lot to you, but I do like this model. It looks dope. This sneaker looks good on foot. You know, huge shot to Hess Kicks once again. This is my Air Max 98. Now guys, this is probably my favorite Air Max in my collection right now. The box is destroyed and uh, I caught these off of eBay for like $200. And it was a overseas release only, and that is the Air Max 93. And this is called the Size Question. Um, it was a Size Question collab, which is like a store in like UK or somewhere overseas. And it was like basically a sneaker that like resembled the Hornets, basically because the Hornets was coming back to Charlotte at the time. I think they brought this shoe out to kind of like, you know, I suck at that word. Commemorate, comm comm commemorate. I don't know whatever the fuck I'm trying to say. Forgive me. But the horn is coming back to Charlotte. However, this shoe did not release in America, which was kind of backwards, but super dope model. I love this model, and I usually wear this every single Air Max day year, but 
this not for today, not for today. And then last but not least from our most recent pickup, that being the Air Max One Ultra 2.0. I know a lot of you guys are mad that this is not as close as the OG, but the people out there that's complaining about these not being close to the OG are the same people who are not gonna be basically, if they, if they would've dropped the OG pair, they wouldn't have even fucking got them. They weren't, they just wanted to complain. They didn't want to say, hey, they're not the same. You wasn't gonna get them if they were the same. Bet, you know what I'm saying? But this is a dope model. I recently picked this up on one of my vlogs. If you haven't checked it out already, go check it out. Overall, though, I like the materials on it. The, uh, you know what I'm saying, is really nice. The uh, canvas, it is not the same as the originals, but it's just something nice to have. It has the 326 on there. And my only main thing wrong with these Air Max ones is the damn toe boxes. It's so big, it looks like a banana boat. But I did a couple shots of B-roll that you probably will be seeing. And I just think overall it was a dope sneaker. It looked good on foot. So I'm going to be rocking these for the day. And matter of fact, let's go a little, do a little quick on foot, man. Let's get it. My bitch so nasty. Uh. My wrist so nasty. Uh. My sweat so nasty. Uh. My car so nasty. nasty, nasty. Diamonds so nasty. nasty, nasty. Trap out so nasty. Ooh. It's looking nasty. Ooh. It's looking nasty. Ooh. Ooh. So nasty. And that shit was a very sloppy. sloppy. Got hella kicks like karate. And I'm barking like wasabi. Money. My wrists are like the puck. Ice. So cold that it's playing hockey. Uh. Got a bad bitch named Quintana. Yeah. She calling me Young Garfo Poppy. Yeah. Yeah. But yeah, guys, this will be my weapon of choice for the day. Comment down below what is your Air Max that you're rocking for today. I would love to hear you guys' comments, thoughts, and opinions down in the comment section down below. Thank you guys for all the love and support. If you have not checked already, I have a Jordan 1 uh, giveaway. Two pairs from Chance Sports. Check that out, the uh, previous video. I will link that down in the description or somewhere along as well. And I want to say thank you guys for all the love and support. And yeah, guys, I love you so much. I'm going to see you guys on the next video. It's your boy, Tony D2Wild. I'm checking in. I'm checking out. Peace. My dime is nasty. Uh, uh, My bitch so nasty. Uh, uh, uh. My bitch so nasty. Uh, My wrist so nasty. Uh, My sweat so nasty. Uh, My car so nasty. Diamonds so nasty. Nasty, nasty, trap out so nasty, Ooh. it's looking nasty, Ooh. it's looking nasty. Ooh.